Yeah. R. Kelly should have been canceled. Wasn't he in like Korea where he was like, who wants to come back to the States no, that with was Kelly? Ethiopia. Yes. Uh, Ethiopia? <laughs> He's literally singing about getting them passports and visas. Who filled out their paperwork? <laughs> <laughs> Meet me backstage. I was born on the South Side. I was raised on the South Side. Everybody stick together like we in the land. Cause it ain't no side like the South Side. All right, welcome to another episode of Cooler by the Lake. Yeah. yeah. The show where we talk all things Southside and we ask important questions. Like if R. Kelly could fly, would he start kidnapping birds? <laughs> I say yes. <laughs> Definitely the baby birds. Uh, <laughs> bring all the vultures to me. <laughs> you might get them in the egg. <laughs> I am Will Miles, one of your hosts. And I'm Langston Kerman. And today we are joined by two very special guests, writers, stars of the show Southside, Chandra and Sutan. Give it up for yeah. them. Thank you. Thank you guys for having us. Thank you for joining us. And in tonight's very special episode of Southside, you just saw it, we know you saw it. Mm -hmm. We see what happens when a little girl goes missing and a whole city goes in panic. Man, they out here snatching kids every day, left and right, up and down, in and out. They snatching them off school bus, everything. Look, they go one right there. We don't even know if that's his baby. Hey! Question we want to ask you guys, the big important question. Very important question. Is do you answer those Amber Alerts? Well, when you say answer, you mean like do I call back and say, hey, I just seen the dude or I ain't seen him? Like, What's do you even acknowledge it? Do you I, go I looking look, for? I look, I look at what type of car it is, but I mean, odds are I'm not about to memorize that license plate. Sure. Because yeah. my memory is not set up like that. <laughs> but, I look, <laughs> but I look, you know, and if I see something suspect, I will. Yeah you know, address it. I like that you're blaming education on why you uh, <laughs> I'm a memorize. public school graduate. Yes, <laughs> there it is. Schools. Yeah. There we go. I was gonna say, I look as well, but I quickly go back to my music. Yeah, Because I yeah. think the odds of me solving that crime or saving someone's life are like zilch to nothing. So, yeah. you know, good it's luck sad. to you, Amber. It is so alert sad. Person. I'm like, this is so sad. <laughs> Another, some of them are like 80. <laughs> <I> oh, <know>, yeah. <laughs> Wait, they're 80 year olds? Dude, Amber's there's alert? older yeah. Am uh, yeah. Amber Alerts too. Oh, yeah. My oh. grandfather's missing. Yeah. I thought it was specific to children. I thought so too. For I that comes it up missing is Amber not gone? a child? Yeah. I think Amber is the first child that went missing, yeah. and then they were like, now we gotta call it Amber Alert, right. cause it's like, they the got the thing passed. Mm. Yeah. Oh, I'm not looking out for no 80 year old. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just saying, I I'm got just one. Saying, if you get kidnapped and you 80, you just kidnapped. Yeah. <laughs> Langston's hatred for the elderly is it's clear. strong. I've got a passion. Do you guys think that heartfelt stories, we're talking about the sad stories and the mm. beatings and shit, mm -hmm. do you think that heartfelt stories have the potential to go viral anymore? Oh my God, yes. Okay. What? Yes, sorry. She's so excited. Oh, sorry. It's already, yeah. Yes, yes. <laughs> it's my favorite thing that went viral. It's this little boy, and I really don't know what town he's in, and I wish I did. But like, his mom was driving to work, and she hit a pothole, like, and her, her tire blew out. And so then this little boy, he's so cute. He just started taking dirt and filling up all the potholes in his area oh, on his own because he didn't nice. want that to happen to anybody else. I was like, yo, some people are just born good. That's like, very sweet. most of us that are born assholes, sweet. but there are just some people. Ugh. Yeah. So <laughs> Wouldn't have been me. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Me neither. I'd have been like, guess we ain't taking that street. <laughs> <laughs> you better call Domino's. They fixing streets now. <laughs> Let me talk to you, son. Let me teach you about life. Yeah. We don't do that. Let's drive down that. We get two pizzas. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think heartfelt stories making it through, becoming uh, viral, uh, I'm just not seeing. I see stupidity coming viral all the time. I just don't think. Sure. I yeah. mean, unless it's something extreme, like there's a guy who's just like in the middle of a river saving small animals and just chucking them and yeah. just, you know, just throwing them to the side yeah. other than that or maybe a baby but other than that um i you know i just I, I see nothing but sheer stupidity and it's funny and i enjoy it mm -hmm. why do you think that is is it just too much stuff now for us to care what's the problem here I don't know. But I don't, maybe people just don't want to feel good. I don't know. I don't know what y'all be on. <laughs> I think. Trying to be sad, dog. I think, yeah. I think it's easier to laugh at someone else's misfortune. Yeah. And, yeah. and may feel better about yourself than it is to yeah. be like, feel bad about yourself because someone else is better than you. So it's easier to look at the negative and be like, oh, yeah. oh your life's shitty. I do pass shit That's like cold. that to like look up like the little white kid who goes, See, I got time, nigga. Like, <laughs> yeah. Thank you. That's yeah. my shit. Thank you. I think it's preference. I think it's yeah. preference, you know, yeah. for Thank for you. how you cultivate your feed. Because my shit is cute, you know. Is it? Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, There's people That's saving nice. animals, yeah. and, you know. Shit. I like to keep it positive. I will you know? say my Instagram is mostly just uh, thick ladies and whale videos. That's yeah. why I don't look at men's phones. I don't play <laughs> I with that. men's feeds because I mean, there's too many ass and titties. It's exhausting. Videos. I like whales. I like thick ladies. Oh, but what happened to all those kids on milk cards? You know? 
Ooh, they grew up. To, they grew up to be adults who put other kids on milk cartons. It's my niece. Meaning they're the reasons n new kids are. Ah, I got you. trauma creates yeah. trauma. There you go. They say it in sure. therapy. Hurt yeah. people, people, hurt people. Hurt people, hurt people. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like there was like a kid in my neighborhood who was on a milk carton, but I, the fact that I don't remember is bad. Yeah. Problematic. Yeah, it's not good. It's not a good reflection of well, any they, of those. They left the no. milk cartons and now they're on Amber Alerts. See, that's yeah, the problem. Right, sure. You can no longer, yeah. and you know, who drinks milk anyway? They're not, that's they, what nobody drinks like regular yeah, milk exactly. no more. They need yeah. to be on the side they of almond milk They need to be on almond milk, milk, yeah, milk yeah, coconut milk, need. oat milks. Some of those Minute milks. Maids. Put it on a back, put it on a, a, a Simply Orange. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you put it on Simply Orange, I'll, I'll find that Put a sad kid. baby on a Simply Orange. <laughs> put it on a pack of Nally. Yeah. We'll oh, find man. <laughs> Post the baked bean pictures and shit. They didn't figure this out early, but if you put kids on flaming Hot Cheeto bags. Oh, my God. Like, They're inside oh, the shit, bag. They, they look, but then you get the red on their faces. Yeah. Like it they looks like they got blood. murdered. <laughs> You don't want that. Oh, that's dark. Just that's stains dark. on these little babies' faces. That's, that's how we're going to end this one. That's and thank it. you guys for coming. We did it. Oh, thank to you Cooler by the Lake. time for Chandra and Sutan. Yeah. Thank you guys for having us. Great guests. I've been Will Miles. I've been Langston Kerman. Good night. Goodbye, my loves. <laughs> Forever and always, we'll be with you. <laughs> See you next week. I was born on the South Side. I was raised on the South Side. Everybody stick together like we in the land. Cause it ain't no side like the South Side.